Hello everyone, happy to see you here and in this video we are going to do a very simple math problem. And you're going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. And I don't want you to use your calculator right here, because here is a problem, as you can see, 30 minus 3 times 2. So what is the correct answer? Of course most of you are there like, yes I can handle this problem, I can handle, this is basic subtraction, basic multiplication, I learned this stuff in the third grade, so that's fantastic. And let's go ahead and write your answer down into a comment section, and right here we will check around are here in just one minute, so we have three options A, B and C, so write your answer down into a comment section, it will be really interesting to check our answers here in just 30 seconds and we will check your math skill of course. Really relaxing algebra problem and I hope you will enjoy this video. Ok, first of all, I want to write this solution, so we have 30 minus 3 times 2. And I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect, I just wanted to show this solution. So 30 minus 3. A lot of students start with this one. 30 minus 3 equal to 27, 27 times 2 equal to 54. Ok, as you can see, 54, a lot of students say ok, 54, option A, this is a correct, correct answer. Ok, but we need to know, then I ask them, ok, what about order of operation? We need to solve it according to some order of operation maybe, yeah? And then I show them, ok, what about this PMDMC order of operation, for example, yeah, maybe you can, uh, you can know, you know about Bodmas right here, but I know about PMDMC, and let's solve it according to PMDMC, because it looks like option A is correct, but if you look at, at order of operation, we have like 30 minus 3 times 2. Let's look at this order of operation, so we have a lot of steps right here, and we will check this step real quick right here. So the first step according to PMDMC, this is parentheses. And let's look at it. Are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those. Let's go to the next step. Are there any exponents right here? No, I don't see any of those. So let's go to the next step. We just keep these two parts. Let's go to the next step. The next step according to PMDMC, this is multiplication and division part. And let's look at our question. Are there any multiplication and division sign right here? Let's look at it. Right here, subtraction. Yeah, we have multiplication sign right here. So we need to know that multiplication is before subtraction. As you can see, multiplication division all the time is before then addition and subtraction. So 3 times 2 equal to 6, ok? And then 30 minus 6 we have, like, like yeah, 30 minus 6, which is equal to 24. And a lot of students don't know what to do with this option, because they say, ok, 24, we don't have it right here, we have 54, we don't have this option right here, we have 20, which is not the same. And then part of students go back to this wrong answer, because they don't see this 24 right here, they cannot like choose one option, and they go back to this 54, but I want to reject, I want to cancel this wrong solution, because this is solution is not according to order of operation, this is like maybe obvious solution, you subtract it first from left to right, you multiply, you have this option right here, it looks like in our minds, yeah, but according to order of operation, this is absolutely wrong solution. And the correct solution according to, of course, PMDMC, this is this 24. But we need to choose one option right here, what is the correct answer? Let's look at it, we have option A, B and C. 24, right here we don't have it, we have we don't have it in option C, but what about this 4 factorial? We still have one option. Let's look at it. Maybe this is the same as 24. So we have 4 factorial right here, which is equal to, we know from school that factorial, this is a product from 1 to 4, and in our case, yeah? 1 times 2 times 3 times 4, yeah? Equal to 1 times 2, 2, 2 times 3 is 6, and 6 times 4, yeah? This is 24. So as you can see, this is option B, this is 24, so option 4 factorial, this is the same 24, this 24, this is the same as our, as our answer, which is absolutely correct, because this is according to PMDMC, this is according to order of operation, and moreover, if you prefer BODMAS, you can easily solve it with the BODMAS, so answer option B is a correct answer. Very tricky and relaxing algebra problem, I hope you are, your answer is the same as mine, but if you made this error, I'm happy you made this, because you won't make this error again, this is a very bad mistake, and I hope you solved it correctly. Definitely wish all the best in your mathematic adventure, thank you for your time and have a great day, if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain test, IQ question, you can easily subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate it. I definitely wish all the best in your mathematic adventure, thank you for your time and have a great day.